I don't think I've been to this part of the building before. Please, make yourself comfortable. I am. Let's begin. Sure. State your name and rank for the camera, please. Uh, Shankar Mondal, uh, Special Inspector, South Asian Affairs, Boston PD. Thank you. So let's start at the very beginning and tell us how you got involved with this case. Sure. Um, let's see. Um, it was Monday, October 7th, 2018. I got a call from my superior officer, and that would be Bill Hayden, to uh, go out to one of the private islands off the coast of eastern Massachusetts. Why you? Because three of the victims were Indian. Uh, I grew up in India, and for the last 10 years, I've been assisting with cases that involve people of South Asian origin. It's standard practice to have an officer present that uh, is familiar with the culture of the victims. Tell us about the case and your investigation process. Sure. Um, let's see now. Uh, four victims, Shinjini Banerjee, age 36, Shamar Choudhury, 45, Sasha Ray, 35, and Shantanu Basu, 36. They had gone to Samar Choudhury's summer lodge, Lake Lucy's Lodge, in Lovell's Island. The boat records show they arrived Friday evening, that's the 4th. When the cleaning personnel arrived on Monday morning, that would be the 7th, the bodies were discovered. The time and cause of death. Uh, sometime between 8 p.m. Sunday night and 2 a.m. Monday morning. The initial assessment... Uh, the exact but... date, please, for the record. Oh, okay. Sorry. Let's see. Um, sometime between 8 p.m. Sunday night, October 6th, 2018, and 2 a.m. Monday morning, October 7th, 2018. The initial assessment was death by carbon monoxide poisoning. Initial? Was that changed? Well, sir, that would be part of the problem. I just couldn't go through with it. I'm sorry. All you had to do was show up. I came there. I just couldn't do it. All you had to do was be there. That's it. That is all that needed to be done. What will I feed you? I don't expect you to feed me. I don't expect any man to feed me. Take care of me. You can't even feed yourself, you spineless bastard. You're angry. Angry? You left me in the marriage office. You bloody left me there. I've never, never in my life have I felt this embarrassed. What I did is a favor to you. You are strong, intelligent, beautiful. You aspire to be a scientist, be someone, go somewhere. But I tried, but I am that cinder block that is tied to your feet that is going to drag you down to despair and disappointment. You are so much better without me. You don't 
ड्रैग मी डाउन यू लिफ्ट मी अप तुम दूसरे मर्दों जैसे नहीं हो यू ऑनेस्ट एंड यू टॉक मी टू रिस्पेक्ट माय सेल्फ तुम मुझे कैसे समझाओ आई वांट यू टू विन दिस वर्ल्ड whether you believe it or not there's a lot of things that you are standing for her main harte hue nahi dekh sakta i just don't have the courage to see i have enough courage for both of us but i need you and that's all i can give that's it now Yeah, Farley. Hmm. You are a busy guy. You have no idea. Remember how we first met? I do. Let's do it again. What? Pretend like we're meeting for the first time. Where do we start? Remember how you came up to me during the convention? Let's start there. Okay. I've been noticing you for a while. Me? Summer, director of Virotech. This is my show. I know who you are. Sasha, tech review. Right now you're the most beautiful thing I've made my eyes. It's a pretty on. small company. Maybe that's why you never heard of us. But your technology is fascinating. You see, I have this bad habit of speaking my mind. Can I ask you out for dinner tonight? Tomorrow I'm flying out and if I don't I'll regret it later. And I don't like regrets. Not bad. You almost remembered all of it. Tell us about your first impressions. Well, Lake Lucy's Lodge is a charming house owned by Summer Choudhury. That's one of the victims. two stories high set on about 2 acres of land the only thing interesting was where the bodies were discovered where were the bodies well um chantanu and uh, sasha were discovered upstairs in their bedroom and in summer and sinjini were discovered downstairs by the fireplace you mentioned interesting what was interesting about that well the local doctor he had ruled death by carbon monoxide poisoning without an autopsy well it was preliminary pending the uh, coroner's report of course you see they had a fireplace that didn't look very clean uh, but it looked like they had used it it was a cold october night and all the windows were shut so the doctor suspected that they'd lit the fire and died of carbon monoxide poisoning it seems like an open and shut case <laughs> except except what well i know a thing or two about dilution sir Well, what do you mean? Well, it was a very big house. 
I mean, the ceilings in the living room were 12 feet tall, and, and then there were the stairs that went up to the bedroom. That's a lot of space. So what? The fire was probably going all night. It didn't add up. I decided to wait for the autopsy. This is what I always wanted to be among friends. The women are asleep. It's just you and me finally, and the world's best whiskey. You know, I would not share this with anyone else. I'm honored. Shantanu, I can help you if you want. You see, our business needs a product photographer and I can recommend your name. I'm good. Thank you. I like that about you. You will break, but you will not bend. Let me leave. You tell yourself. I think it's your fear. Shri says that you don't come to sleep at night. You don't eat well, you don't eat well, you don't eat well. And when I see the shares of news, I see only the virus. The shares are volatile because somebody from the company is leaking news to the media. What are you doing, boss? Shri has told me. I'm glad she cares. It's all part of the package, Shantanu. With fame and success comes stress. I'll let you know a secret. ये जो news में सब खबर फैल रही है ना वायरोटेक की, वो मेरे ही आदमी करवा रहे हैं. Hype is necessary for the business, especially right before your big launch. But isn't that illegal? It's a matter of perspective. So what is this product? It's a prototype. The perfect vehicle. A virus that can actually change the DNA in a human body. You see, whatever changes you want at the DNA level, you incorporate that in this virus genome. The virus can be ingested, does not need to be injected. It gains access into the bloodstream through the gut and carries the cargo and delivers where needed. The perfect delivery system. So, surgical strike without the surgery, huh? Precisely. Salo lagge se banane mein hume. Pata hai Shantanu mein har ek trial mein har disease model pe ye virus try karna chahta hoon. Main biotech ko asman ki us uchai par pochana chahta hoon jaha aaj tak kisi biotech company ne jaane ki sochi bhi na ho. To success. To success. So what did the autopsy reveal? Well, the coroner returned the verdict of death by asphyxiation, carbon monoxide poisoning. But I wasn't convinced. I decided to request for additional lung and brain stains. Lung and brain stains? Histology of the lung tissue, sir. You see, the carbon monoxide, it leaves telltale signs of damage, uh, pulmonary edema, cerebral edema. I just wanted to be sure. Summer initiated the leaks? That's what he said? That's what he said. Magar kyun wo jhoot kyun bolega? He knows he's not the leak. And how would you know that? Because I am the leak. What? I tweaked the genome so it becomes a perfect tool for mRNA delivery. Aren't viruses supposed to be dangerous? I edited the genome so it becomes hemoglobin compatible without harming the cells. So that's what he was talking about. But he didn't mention you. And why are you the leak? Is it because he's not giving you the due recognition? So what do you think? I don't care about the recognition. But I've always been afraid of what Summer is capable of. What? All animal models have failed. 
this virus that I created? Shantanu, what I'm about to tell you is top secret. This virus gets in the It asphyxiates you. What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. It's a biological weapon and he plans to sell it to the highest bidder. What? I know Summer. He's not capable of something like this. Or besides, somebody is going to know, right? This is the next big thing. And Summer and some very influential people are trying to keep it confidential. This virus has so much potential for treatment and delivery. But it won't be for the money. And Summer Chaudhary only knows money. He won't even file for a patent. I just can't believe Summer is capable of a thing like this. Why can't we just go to the higher authorities? I think that the government has also been in all To the highest level. Can you imagine the power a government would hold over someone if they have a weapon like this in their arsenal? It's all about the money. And we have to change that. Do you trust me? खुद से भी ज़्यादा श्री, अगर कोई कुछ बदल सकता है वो तुम हो। तुम मुझे छोड़के क्यों चले गए? मैं तुम्हें कमज़ोर कर देता। आज तुम्हारे पास क्या कुछ नहीं है? सिवा तुम्हारे। ये सब बातें करके क्या फायदा? समर को हमारे बारे में पता नहीं है। अगर उसे पता चला वो सब कुछ जला के राख कर देगा। Summer has to go. For once, I'm gonna use the evil thing that I created to do something good for this world. Okay, so what did the lung stain show? The lungs have diffuse alveolar in, in, damage. In plain English, officer. Well, it's not carbon monoxide poisoning the pattern of damage in the lungs don't match. So? So, death by asphyxiation from unknown toxin. That was the conclusion, sir. The same for all four bodies? Uh, yes, sir. What is this then? Group suicide? Unlikely. Um, I mean, we didn't find a suicide note or anything. Besides, they were not cult people. Summer Chaudhary was the... I, I know what you're implying. They don't fit the profile. So now what? Murder? Summer Chaudhry was a big shot, right? Mm, it's not an inside job. See, if one of them were to murder the others, then we would have victims and survivors. Over here, everyone is a victim. An outsider then? Uh, we checked. Uh, no one fit the profile. No one else came and went that weekend. Lucy's Lodge has no access except by boat. No boat left the dock that night according to your report, right? That's right. None. We checked. Hmm. I think we can rule out murder then. What else is left? Accidental death, sir. Accidental ingestion of unknown toxin. But what toxin? Did you check the surrounding area? Any poisonous plants? Mushrooms they might have picked up while hiking and consumed. Any illegal drugs they may have been taking that were spiked. Anything? Anything on the crime scene? Uh, nothing obvious, sir. But the more I think about it, it must be something like that. Any sign of violence? Uh, none. What about in their personal effects? Nothing out of the ordinary. Painkillers, makeup kits, uh, homeopathic meds. Homeopathic? Uh, Nux vomica, sir. Uh, it's a, it's a cure-all kind of a drug that Indian people use all the time. Is it legal here? Oh, yes, sir. You can buy it on Amazon. Hmm. Well, what are we going to call this one? Accidental death by ingestion of unknown toxin. Uh, we've, we've taken some samples for future analysis, but other than that, it's a cold case for now.
tell me. Calling on a secure line. It was your wife that tried accessing the papers. How do you know? Logan Addy. She used a proxy IP address, but it was not that hard to trace it to her. Besides, she is the only one who has access to all the data like you. How long do you think it will take for her to figure things out for herself? These leaks will ruin everything. The government will pull the plug if there is a backlash from this. Forget the funding after that. You need to take care of her right now. I will. A taste of her own medicine ought to do the job. Have they gone for a walk? Yep. I need to talk to you. About? Us. We need to stop this. This cannot go on. Why? A dead spineless excuse of a man say something to you? You have no right to insult him! I'm not some roadside trash that you pick, use and throw away, Sasha. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Don't be a child, Somar. We knew this would not continue. Why? Because now suddenly you grew a conscience? You are mine, and I will have you no matter what. You will destroy our lives and yours. Think about Shantanu and Sinjani. I can't imagine you're comparing me. Samar Chaudhary to that spineless husband of yours. And don't forget, Sasha, it was my charity that got you going as a reporter when your husband was unemployed. Wait a minute, he still is. He can't take care of you, Sasha. I can. I had my doubts, Sama. But thanks to you, they're cleared. You don't care about anyone but yourself. You're not half the man he is. Sinjani is your wife and you're not thinking twice before destroying your marriage. Our marriage was a business deal that is long over. And anyway, you won't have to worry about her anymore. One less weight on your conscience. What do you mean? You will see. You know, I wish we could come on vacations like this more often. Just us. But I thought you don't enjoy my company. And you've been wrong before. I, I'm a little confused, Sasha. So was I. I'm sorry that I never tried understanding you. No. No. The fault was not yours. I mean, 
You expected a lot from this relationship and I couldn't deliver. The faults were all mine, but you had to bear all along. Can we start over, Shantanu? Of course, Sasha. Of course, yes. I'm tired of running. I just want to settle down. I don't want to run anymore. I'm tired of running. I want you to declare this carbon monoxide poisoning. But Shankar thinks otherwise. An unknown. I don't want the term toxin mentioned anywhere in the report. If you can't get it done, Steve, I'll find someone who will. Oh, oh I, I will. You know what's at stake here. All it takes is one nosy reporter, and we don't want this traced back to us. It's a matter of national security. I understand. But shouldn't we just find out how they died? Ignorance is bliss, Steve. Just get it done. Holy Sunnah!